What's up everyone, the Cybernet8610, and today we have more random pack openings for for today, and uh, we're going to be picking out 10 of these packs, and let's hope we do well with them. All right, so yeah, let's go on ahead, we have, let's see, 2, 4, 6, 8, and 10. So there we go. All right, then we'll put the others to the side. Oh, that pack does not want to go in the pile. There we go. Save those for another random pack opening, and let's see what we got for this random pack opening. Photon Shockwave Generation Force. I still love... Uh, not Generation Force, sorry. The Duel's Genesis. I'll say, I said that completely wrong. And uh, another uh, Phantom Darkness. Hopefully we'll get something good from that. Get that Yubel card like we wanted last time, right? Let's see. Photon Shockwave first. Again, no particular order. I just kind of go with it. Alright, let's see. Hopefully we will do well with these random packs. And let's see, we've got one day apiece. That's pretty good. Gishki Beast and Black Raid Lancer. We already got one of these actually from a random pack opening so far. Again, I still think it looks awesome. It's a pretty cool card. And um, I don't know. I hope maybe in the future I can actually use this card in something. Let's see. We have Dolus Genesis. Stardust Dragon, please. I know that's the one I always ask for, but that's the one I want. Really badly. I'd love to have another ghost one. Let's see, what do we have? We have a Graceful Revival, and aw, not today, I guess, right? Oh well, one of these days it will happen. All right, we have Photon Shockwave. There we go. All right, Photon Lead. So we have Evosora Diplo. For our rare. Power of the Duelist. Now maybe we'll get our Hollow Neos card. I don't think we got one yet. All right, we have a Super Vehicle Roid Jumbo Drill. Uh, actually, an awesome card to get. Super rare, uh, one of the Roid cards. Again, it's one of those archetypes I really uh, I thought was awesome. I'm hoping again that it might get smart in the future. Yet I don't know. I mean, they did get I guess the Bicycle Roid or whatever its name is, the one in, of course, a Dragon's Legend. But I don't, I don't know if that really, I don't think that really helped them or anything. I want to see more support, more than one card, and that, you know, will actually help them out a little bit more. But, at least we saw something for them. Uh, yeah, freaking awesome card. I think there's still some from the manga and stuff, too, that were never printed over here, so maybe we'll get those. Tactical Evolution. There is support out there. They just print them, I think. I think that's right. I think there's still some even from the anime that were never printed. See, so we have uh, Common Charity. Oh, Jama Knight. I remember that being a pain to get. I don't know if that was short printed back then or what. It was a pain to get, though. Crimson Crisis. I remember, I don't know how many packs opened. I remember, though, my first pack of Tactical Evolution, I got a Rainbow Dragon. And that's something I have never forgotten. I think I've said that plenty of times in videos, but, you know, I think it's awesome. Star Blast. Another Tactical Evolution. Let's see. So far we got two Super Rares. That's pretty good. Venom Shot. And we have a Crystal Seer, which is... That would have been so epic back then. It is still pretty epic, though. It's a, a Ultra Rare card, and I always thought this one looked really cool as well. It has a actually pretty cool effect, and... Yeah, ultra rare. That's just... That's a card I have not seen in quite a while, actually, now I think about it. I remember a lot of people wanting to get this card. It's freaking awesome looking. An ultra rare as well. That's just cool. And counter counter. The true best card of the set. Let's see, we have Phantom Darkness. Come on, give me you bell. I want one of the Ubel forms. I'll, I'll settle for any of them. I mainly want the, the strongest one, but any of them will do. Heat Buster. Oh, I was for a second, I thought maybe that was like a Neos, like a Fusion or something that was uh, a holographic. Still looks cool. I didn't know why they never made like next versions of all of them though. That would have been awesome. Like for Air Hummingbird and all of them too. They only did for Glow Moss and then they did for uh, Aqua Dolphin. And even Dolphin got a, an actual Fusion after the next Fusion. When uh, Glow Moss, I don't think, no it didn't. Let's see, Copy Knight for our rare. And then, last pack, Power of the Duelist. Let's see. So we can get something awesome from this. Let's hope so. Still have not got my holographic Neos card. Come on. Heart of the Cards. 
we have Destiny Hero Dasher, and, well, we got Neo. So, part of the cards were kind of listening, they just forgot the hollow part. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, it's pretty awesome, though. I like Destiny Hero Dasher, I always thought he had a cool design to him. Uh, but yeah, we got, let's see, we got two super rares, and then we got an ultra rare. So definitely good. I, I'm happy with that. And it's always fun to open up these older packs anyway, so that's just awesome in itself. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. Hopefully you're looking forward to the next random pack opening. And of course, uh, as always, give me ideas too for other openings you want to see in the future, you know. Whether it be, you know, ways to improve random pack openings to, uh, you know, boxes, tins, and that kind of stuff you want to see on, on the channel as well. As always, thank you for watching, and of course, I will catch you guys later. See ya.